Whoops. Let's see if I can get a good wheel this time. Oh, man. Oh, keep dokey. Oops. A big, big red box. Good morning, Sarab. Oh, this is loud. A big red box for where is Bryn? No, because they didn't. A lot of people didn't actually realize that it was Bryn. So actually, if we don't have the box, we're okay. I think. I think we're okay. Man, I can't wait for the update and then I don't have to worry about this stupid gold key timer anymore. God, I can't wait for that. That's such a nice update. Um, Justin, it's Alliance. It is Alliance. Which actually, can you see that? Well, it's blue, but I guess you can't really tell. But yeah, it's Alliance. It's lightning. It is lightning. And I'm... Oh yeah, I don't have enough yet. Ah, that's right. I have enough to pull for this, though. I only need one more, right? What was I just about to do? Tavern. No, there's no advanced wheel in tavern. So I need one more. Oh yeah, that's what I was going to do. I was going to go buy wheel tokens because I got to go buy... I got to buy up a bunch so that I can finish that. And get a can. Alright, but in the meantime, I need to buy one advanced token. Should I just waste gems, or should I spin, knowing that I'm probably going to finish? No, I'll just play peaks. Wait, he's not throwing, right? Okay, he's not throwing. Okay. So if he's not throwing, then rolling for Ultima and Advanced Wheel... Nah. Not worth it. I I just need the gold. So actually what you have to do is you have to re-roll it until this is the 4-star Heaven and Hell shard. Because that way it goes off the wheel when you pull it. Because otherwise it's um, bound artifact, which I don't want. So it's actually better to do this. That's actually better. Okay. So I just need to get one. I just need to hit seven one time. Not with these heroes, though. Oh, boy, not with these heroes. I'm not worried about collecting Ultimas because I have 140 converts, and so I'm very sure that I will get... Hey, Alban, I'm very certain that I will get at least some from converts. I'm not worried at all about that. Hi, Jerky. I am not at all worried about getting the copies of Ultima. Also, I can always buy them from Soul Shop anyway, so... It's like, whatever. I'll get them when I get them. You broke... 
I don't know how you break down a skin by accident. They give you messages to tell you whether or not you want to do it. Hi, Vidya. It takes quite a bit of extra effort to break down a skin. Wow, can I have some, like, acceptable heroes that aren't complete trash? No, I cannot. Okay. Okay. What? A Brin already? And a Sigurd and a Dr Oh my god, okay. That's a loss at four. This one seems more doable. This is dumb. Next team critique will be next week sometime. Oh my god. Can I get non-trash heroes? Wolf Rider tank? Mmm. Meh? I don't think it helps all that much gonna have you tank with this for now hi kubakia wolf rider tank is kind of weird all right all right you stole energy from themis and martin that helps oh hey i made it to six i think yeah, I made it to six. Woohoo! Hey, Notch. Mage, 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 mage. I don't know. I think I'm pretty doomed anyway. Whatever. Uh, Kalpa, that is correct. That's a loss. Oh, that's a win! That is a win. How did I win that? I don't even know. What does this do again? Speed. Uh, so next event is most likely going to be Lightning, the new, the new hero. Oh. This is... There's no way I win this. So, whatever 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 don't care i made it to seven and therefore i get one advanced token and that's all i needed all right let's take our advanced token and use it so yes they have changed it it's no longer brin this is why i told people not to get too attached to it being brin nobody knew whether it would or would not be and so it's not brin All right, let's go. I don't care about this debt laugh, but I wouldn't mind a star. I am getting a lot of gold, actually. Flags. Flags are actually not good. Hi, Mamad. Oh, I got it. I got it. What was that? I got it at one. So I spent 60, 58, 58 tokens? No, 54, 64, 63, 63. So that was 70. So no, I got it at 480. Look, I only spent 70. You can see that I only spent 70. That means that I got 484 points. Unless I criticaled 16 times out of 70. But that is... That's very rare. I hit 4... Oh. Then I crit a lot. Alright, I'll take that. I'll take a lot of crits. Can get... Okay.
Oh, whoa, wait a minute. So that got 12 points. Oh, wow, there's a lot of crits in this. Oh, I got the Martin. Wait, why is it Martin? Did I refresh it? Why did I refresh it? Why did I refresh? All right, whatever. All right, not great, but... Oh, so with 40 more, I got 47 points. That's not bad. It auto-refreshes because I got the star? Okay, that makes sense. What a waste of my refresh. It drops the gold down, too. What a waste. All right, so with the star... Huh! Star, shar, star shards is in here. What a... I started at 414, but if I rolled 70 times and got 86 points, then... Cool? That's actually... That means I crit like crazy. That's a lot of crits. So, not bad. Alright, so I'm just gonna buy this. I am gonna work towards this. I'm kinda done with... Well... Uh, actually. So 16 of these versus 17 of these. I guess considering it's going to take me like three months or four months to get one star, it doesn't really matter too much, huh? Uh, Lynn, do you mean... Oh, yeah, this week will be is boring. And you know what? I like it that way. I like having boring weeks. Because then you don't have to think too much about it. So that means I crit like crazy. That's pretty amazing, actually. That is actually pretty crazy. That is like a good 20% crits. That's a lot. I haven't pulled in a while, so I didn't know that the crit rate was so high. Hi, Abhishek. Doing pretty good. Wow. That is a lot of wheel tokens, so that's how they get you. That's how they get you, by making you buy them like crazy. A dollar each, huh? A dollar each just seems very expensive. All right, well, um, if, uh, hey, look at all these free gems. Speaking of free gems, I like free gems. You know, I also have not figured out what the best way is to do damage to this boss. Like, I can't... I don't think that this is the best team for me. I don't think Aegina is enough. Now, Bold did it with an 88 Wanderer on Chessia. But what if instead of Aegina, I just run this? What if I just run Veg instead of Aegina? Aegina is there to... Or Veg would be there to buff... Uh, that one's kind of a tough one, actually.
Hi, Boku and Jer. All right. Well, this should still be a... Oh, no! Sigurd lost his energy. That sucks. Chessia lost her energy. Oh, God. If I win this, it's going to be sad because I, I took off all my energy artifacts. I don't even... Did Bryn have energy? Maybe she did. Uh, next event should be the new hero. That is correct. That's what we think it's going to be, at least. Ouch. Wow. Alright, so my artifacts are completely all wrong right now. That is what I got. You have the wrong one. Does that mean you both... You... They all had the wrong one. Oh my god, all my artifacts are wrong. Oh. She even had the wrong artifact. Okay, hold up. Okay, so at least you have the right talents. Wait, I am not using Ultima yet. Arwen, Aegina, Rin, Sig. Okay, hey Minato. Mm, oh, and Hodor. Wait, so I have one, two, three, four. I have four sets of red one. Okay, yeah, I have four sets. Hi, Ilhan. So the reason that I can't use Ultima is that one Ultima actually makes the firing order really dumb. It doesn't guarantee the firing order that I need it to. So therefore, I'm going to wait until I get two of them. Hi, Vunkit. So I will be slowly working on a second one, but like my alliance fodder is not that good right now, so I have to figure out what I'm going to do. I'm, it's going to be very hard for me to build multiple alliance heroes. So that's why we will be banking a lot on pulling keys and getting, pulling, uh, getting fodder for there. Is Bryn pull okay? Um, well, now that you can no longer pull Bryn from keys, you don't have to think about it. It is no longer Bryn. Alright, so that puts me at, I think, 24. 24 shard, skin shards. So I need six more. Yikes. These skin shards are very tedious to get. Very, very tedious to get. Alright, so actually what I do also want to do is I want to try and force finish Fuse. Because I will not be able to rely on the key event to get fodder. Um, my Fuse does reset the day, the final day of the wheel event. And so I will have to I'll have to finish fuse before that. Come on. And so now the real struggle is how am I going to finish fuse where all I have is three six stars and I'm skipping the 10 star this time because I didn't get an extra one. Or I didn't make anything. What well, would be the hero in chest? Do I still have the picture?
Where did I put it? Hmm, where did I put it? I deleted it. Why would I do such a thing? Unless it's this one. Nope, that's a different thing altogether. The The key's reward is going to be the new hero, Lightning. I deleted the image, so I have to go download it again. Oh, wait. Maybe I didn't delete it. Here? Yeah, there it is. This is the new hero. Hey. Um, Murad, I mean, it's up to you. I think it's worth it because what if you re-roll it and you get a 7 star? Or you get a 6 star or something? It's, it's not such a bad idea. If you have 520... How do you have 520? Oh, you must have pulled Skulled. Everyone got baited. If you can't make it to 740 or 727, 726 by that day, which you probably can't... Actually, wait. 520? You can... If you haven't played Peaks yet this week, then you might be able to reach two rounds. Uh, BIOS, it works, but the problem is with one Ultima, the team becomes very unreliable. Um, like, if you, f if you use one Ultima and, like, your Skull is in front or something it can make other heroes faster than your scold and then now she will not she won't um she won't cleanse them so it can really throw off everything she, she is an alliance mage that has some weird stun mechanics okay so with two of them it goes okay it's actually bad to control their energy. Because their single hits hurt. But, oh well. It works. 520 is nothing. If you have 520, it means you've been pulling a lot. And you shouldn't have been. You should have been saving. There was no reason to pull at all. Unless you knew for certain that you just didn't want the new hero. Like, we always knew that there would be a new hero coming eventually. That was always on the table. And so, regardless of what effect it has on you, the smartest thing to do was to save your keys. God, I cannot get armor. I am just not getting armor at all. And I'm not doing good on helmets either. Wait a minute. Armor and helmet. How about... Armor! Bye. Oh, cool. I have an accessory in there too. There's no better thing to use luck coins on. Woohoo! Okay, so that got me almost not even close. Not even close. Good God. Good God. Oh, well. The cool thing is I can sell all of these at some point and get a good 60 million gold, but I don't really need them. Uh, Jer, 
my personal plan is to always try and have 200 on hand but it's honestly it's impossible to know sometimes there's really good heroes and eyes sometimes there aren't it's impossible to really know what's going on hero chest Brynn is a bait how can it be bait how can it be bait? It's not Brynn anymore. Uh, Subaru's Guardian. The best way to gather keys is by playing Peaks. All new players, every player, should be spending their 3,700 3, gems on 10 rounds of Peaks every single week. You have 190 now. Can you make it to 300? You have two weeks, so you have one round of... You have honor bets this round. You have one fuse and one full round of honor. So two fuse, two fuses is 20 plus tavern is... What is it? 19 or 13? 13. 43. No, 33 plus honor... Honor, you can get another three, no, six. So you can get up to 40, 10 heroic runes, 50. You're going to have to place really well in honor. You see, Jer, the point of saving is not so much that you can say you're saving, but... It's just waiting for the right time to pull. And you just pull whatever you, ha you happen to have. Mr. Foddy, I guarantee you, you earn more than that. Free to play. Free to play earns like 5,000, almost 6,000 a week. Oh, you can't see it anymore. Ah, oh, they changed this. So you earn like 140 from this plus 240 from this. That's 380. Plus the arena ranking is probably like another 10 plus tavern, whatever you get. In one day, you could probably make a good 200 gems from here. So you can make 600 gems, up to 800 gems a day, especially if you manage to land some friends bosses. So you make 800 gems a day plus the weekly. I can't see what's in here anymore. There's another like 100 gems in here, I think. So let's say you make 700 gems a day. That's 4,900 a week, plus another like three to 400 from the weekly. You make way more than 3,700 gems a week, free to play, without doing anything extra. You make way more than that. So if you aren't spending your gems on peaks, you're, or you don't have enough to spend on it, you're doing something wrong. That actually is the shortest answer. You are you are wasting your gems in places that you should not be wasting them. And peaks is the best investment because for 400 gems, you can get up to 10 keys. For 400 gems, you can get up to 10 keys. There is no place in the game you can get them that cheap. And even if you only stop it, even if you die at six, every single time. Even if you die at six, every single time, 400 gems gets you six keys and some gold. 400 gems for six keys, if you're not, if you're not buying that all day long, it's ridiculous. How many keys do I have? I have... 1997 because i have not pulled since sigurd i have not pulled a single gold key it since sigurd wait wasn't i in the middle of a peaks round oh no i was doing expedition familiar quest i don't get cans from that i got i get one can in two weeks from the familiar quest Speaking of which, I haven't done it on this account yet, so let's go and try it. Duh. 
Okay, so I didn't get it there. Let's try this. Anyway, can you make it to 300? Only if you do really well in honor. And in bets. You may have to buy some. Well, I know how. It's called you hacked the game, you dirty cheater. Woohoo! Okay. Alright. Let's go. Can I get a can on my Chinese account? No, I cannot. I cannot. Oh, whoops. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, well, I wasted a gold key. Well, Jerky, the point is that you get a lot from all of those. You get enough to wear peaks is free, plus you earn more. And that's what people got to realize is that peaks is like almost required. If you ever want to pull gold keys, you have to be playing peaks. Ah, I'll do this later. I don't feel like I don't feel like doing this. Peaceful day, my butt. Peaceful day, my butt. I don't want no peaceful days. Oh, I can actually kill it with nine hits. Nice. And just like that, I got 800 gems. I mean... If you have 200 keys, you done messed up. You done messed up. You pulled all of your keys last round. What the? This guy has 298 power. Wow. 298. Wait, that actually hurt me. I took more damage than I did. Kurt took 10% of his life just to fight that fight. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Wow. That means it's actually worse to fight weaker teams. Unless I had Valkyrie. If I had Valkyrie, that would be okay. But I don't. You see, Gum, there was never going to be anybody happy by either decision. If it was Bryn, people would be unhappy. If it was New Hero, people would be unhappy. Honestly, at this point... You can't, you can't make anyone happy, so why bother trying? Just do the best with, that you can with what you've got and work from there. Uh, Mayank, that is because you're not far enough. If you are past level 65 in Planet Trial, they are much cheaper. It's not worth it to buy them before that point. 570 Moonstones for Bryn? That's an oddly specific number. And also incorrect, because it would be 540. But 
She is probably worth it. Bryn is probably one of the few heroes that will be worth it. Like, I don't think Sigurd or a, a Hodor is not worth it, for sure. Skuld is, like, sort of worth it. And Sigurd probably is worth it. But even... But it depends how many. Three copies is, like... It's better to stop at 1150. You're wasting an extra 100 keys in order to um, just to get like 20 moonstones. So if you think about it, you're spending 100 keys for 20 moonstones, which is effectively one ninth of a hero. However, 100 keys is one fourth of a hero. So you're, you are spending to get less than you are spending. Um, okay, Patrick, well, you can worry about that all you want. The answer is actually nobody knows. But most likely it will be 180. There's no reason for it not to be. If Skuld is 180, there's no way, there's no way that Bryn would be more. Wow, this guy has all skins. This team is all skins. Tiger King, Luna, Martin skin. Wow, these are all red skins. No, the Tiger King's not. Luna is, Martin is. The other ones were red. See, like I said, nobody's happy with this. Nobody's happy. I'm happy. I actually would rather see the new hero anyway. Bryn has been available too many times. There's a lot. There should be most people have, should have had the ability to get her to T4. It's Sigurd that it's more understandable that everybody is wishing for, but Bryn has been available enough times that it's like whatever. Uh, Reshav, whichever one you need more. You cannot tell, you cannot, one is not always better than the other. Oh, wow. This guy went up to first. This guy? He doesn't even have a second Rilia skin. What are you doing, man? Uh, Jayesh, they have not leaked. They've only... The only thing we know is the rough explanation, which is she does something that enables other heroes to stun. She lands, um, like a shock effect on heroes that gives them a higher chance to be stunned when they get hit, and that's all we know. are such trash heroes these are such trash heroes what do you want from me all right this is a two ultima one ultima is fine for like regular fights but it's like you don't even need him her versus a super strong team one ultima is not enough This is, this is trash. This is trash. I'm going to die at three. Well, we'll just die at three and be done with it. Whatever. Yellow skin? They're all bad. They're all bad. When am I going to build my third scold? Well, if four more copies fall in my lap, I'll build her.
like I don't have enough copies to do it yet so there's like nothing I can do about that uh oh okay Whew. what is this too Honestly, I'm not sure that skipping New Hero for Brynn is a good idea yet. Nobody knows. I mean, I would rather pull for the New Hero and find out, but that's just me. Other people would be okay with waiting. Why are you all... Wow, Wolf Rider landed a full frontline stun. Yeah, screw you too. Jeez. All right, so now I need an energy. This is a dumb team. This is such a dumb team. I need like a Sigurd or a... It's winning. Hey, I made it to five. I'm actually very impressed that I made it to five. Mars, not Mars. Mars is not what I want. Lindbergh is not a wanderer, last I checked. Ooh. Alright. Robin, go away. Last I checked, Lindbergh was not a wanderer. I actually I advocated for Mars for a little bit like early on but then it turned out just to not be worth it ouch oh wait who died wait who did I have back here Chessia Chessia died ouch uh oh this is actually looking pretty bad yeah this is dead okay all right, well, dying at five is actually better than I expected. Oof. Nope, we're gonna die at five. New hero might revive Mars. New hero could make Lindbergh interesting. Also, Wolf Rider. All right, let's go! Nobody died. Bomb died. And Chessia is stunned. Okay, well. It was nice knowing you guys. Ouch. Wait. I won! Oh, a tank. I made it to six! Hmm, you think the new hero would work with Mars? I mean, it's possible. The problem is that most Mars are built for speed. So really, everybody that should work with the new hero potentially is going to need, is generally already fast. So if lightning turns out to be really slow, it's going to be bad. Like you're going to, oof. You're going to have to fight really hard to... Working with weakness? I mean, until we know what she does, we can't really say who or what she works with at all. Man, this is all trash. I need an energy. Oops, that helps too. I need an energy. Uh, Tony, I find going to 110 is the safest because if you're, if you're pulling f advanced wheel aiming for the red skin then you should be also trying to get that yellow can that's at 60. And so getting 99, 97 on hand to be able to pull 110 is a, is a very solid bet. Wow, this team beat 7. 
Wow, how did I get here? How did I get here? Alright, now I really want an energy. Did not get an energy. Alright, well, the f okay, now I'm dead. That's okay. Weakness actually does not affect Hodor. Death affects Hodor. That one for sure. Wait, what? How did I... What just happened? Chessia. Chessia did something ridiculous. How did I win that? I... I... What? This is gonna be... Oh, oh okay. We'll go with that. So I never made it to energy. Somehow Reaper ended up with speed. Wow, what a team for 10. Get out of here. Well, let me just lose real quick. Okay, okay. None of nothing makes sense. Nothing makes sense. Okay. Okay. We're going to What the hell just happened? All right. So, right here Hodor died turn two. Bomb killed second place. Both Aegina's fired and killed everything, but Walnir and Reaper just survived. Walnir and Reaper just somehow survived the double Aegina burst. Okay, okay, okay. And this one? What in the world? Look at this. He's got four energies on this. Chessia is... Wait, what just happened? I killed this Vivienne. How did I kill Vivienne? Whoa, everyone is silenced. Wow! Only H Hodor died. Ouch. You know, if I say anything, it's that Walmir is the most godlike tank in Peaks. That is really my answer. Walmir is a godlike tank in Peaks. Or, Bomb is MVP. Right? Should we just say that Bomb carried me to that victory? God, how did he survive? Okay, well, I'll take it. I mean, a 10 is a 10. That's, that's amazing. How did I win that? <sighs> that is crazy that is crazy man if i'm gonna hack can i just hack red can or yellow cans i'd rather hack that i don't want to hack peaks wins peaks wins don't mean anything to me only triggered once so that one turn of survival is turned out to kill everything. Wow. 
Hodor, the, I didn't even really have double Hodor. This one got gargoyled at the very beginning and stayed gargoyled until everything happened. So this guy didn't do anything. Like, none of his passives worked. Wow. I did not deserve that win. All right. Well, we will take a 10. Holy cow. Hey, I have 278. I can actually get a... Idol Mystic? I haven't heard of that. Hodor Silence. I'm telling you, the first Hodor, or the second Hodor, was gargoyled the whole time. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We doing it. We doing it. We not doing it. Let's go! Reaper only silences warriors. Hodor has, what, 25% silence? And he hits three people? Something like that? I gotta check that. Bring it! Wait a minute. You know what? I think I need to tank with Abyss Lord, not Lionheart. Oh, let's go! Let's go! It's 637, 636, 641, 638. Gosh, Wolf Rider is slow. Star Shards Monkey King? Mmm, I guess so. I'm not sure about that. Mon Monkey King... Hmm. I need to check on Monkey King. So his skill hits frontline. Wait a minute. He petrified two. Why did he petrify two? Does that mean it's each person is two forty-eight percent? Uh, so what the hell do you mean? What is an NFT game? How does that make sense? I'm I still don't understand NFTs too well, so you'll have to bear with me on that. All right, I'm gonna take a look at this while I. Let us go Google Idol Mystic. What the heck? How can you give away NFTs that are worth something? Holy what? The world's first 3D NFT blockchain game. What does that even mean? Oh, we are on. We are so on. I want to make a six Monkey King team. All right, I'm checking. I want to check this link out. It will be. Oh, it's released next week. Wow, they really did just pull the sprites from Tap Tap, huh? What the heck? Whoa, their trailers.
wait, each hero is an NFT? Well, they have a really nice opening movie. the heck is this? This is so weird. Lionheart- No, Lionheart's good. Lionheart stuns. Wow, why does he petrify too? So when they say 48% chance to petrify, it's 48% for every single hero. That's- Really? That's really high. Oh my god, Monkey King is godlike in peaks. Monkey King is straight up godlike in peaks. Uh, the Rock, you might want to check out their Facebook. They give a they give a rundown of what the new hero can do. All right, let's go with dodge. Normally, I wouldn't take dodge, but because I already have 15% from this, I'm going to go for it. Uh, my dodge is not working so well. But I have so much stun. Wolf Rider controls the front, Monkey King controls the front, Lion Hearts control the back. This is actually a very strong team. This is a very strong team. Alright, I'm kind of curious about this game. Wait, oh no, you have to... What the? You have to buy the game. You have to buy the game for 90 bucks. Are you serious? It costs 90 bucks to buy. That's no good. Hey, you killed my wolf rider. Hey, you killed my Vegvis here. HP is good enough. If I could get Bryn too. I mean, I understand the game is not out, but it says to buy a key. I assume that means to buy a key to play it. I need a Bryn. Well, almost, I mean, the safe thing is, is to say that every team needs Bryn. Wow, he had two Sigurds. I just realized that. Too bad the second Sigurd does not revive. Yo, I'm at nine. It's on. It's so on. Actually, Watchmen was a it was an interesting choice. He's pretty good. It's so on. Can I make it to ten with this? Maybe. Oof. Maybe not. But yeah, like to buy it. It says buy key. I assume that that means. I assume that you need a key to play. Or no, wait. You buy multiple keys. I don't know. But it's very... Ex whatever this key is, it's 90 bucks. Oh no. My monkey king. My monkey kings are dying. 
Oh, school. Hmm. One last chance to get another Monkey King. Nope. Okay. Are you kidding me? What is this nonsense? What is this nonsense? Alright, so I don't understand this. What, what does this mean to buy keys? And the thing about NFTs is they only have value if people want them. Who cares about buying NFTs or copies of a character in a game that no one plays? That doesn't make sense to me. Okay, well, Skull already used her revive. One Kurt down. This Kurt doesn't seem to want to die, though. That's kind of hurting me. Ouch. Uh-oh. No, I died. Ah, well. I made it to nine. With this. Monkey King front? I didn't want Monkey King front. I wanted Monkey King back because I wanted Lindbergh to kill himself on the reflect. That was my goal. I made nine. Nine's good. I still got... I mean... The problem was that they had too much healing. But... I couldn't replace Veg. I didn't get anybody better than Veg. Oh god. Monkey King front for damage. Okay. I just didn't get the final the final spots I needed. Oh my god. Okay, well, from there, now we get to die at 3. Now we will die at 3, so... I haven't had enough experience using Monkey King, the new Monkey King in Peaks, so I don't know. I I usually like to put the stronger heroes in back, but I guess because Monkey King is so strong now, then yes, he deserves to be in front. Like it's a, it's kind of a tricky thing. Quite honestly, seeing Monkey Kings in this Peaks, I've probably seen him maybe two or three times total in like 30 40 runs so it's like i just haven't had a chance to play with monkey king like i still it still boggles the mind how strong he he can be should i pre-register for this idol mystic I mean, if I get an NFT of Olivia, that's it. That's all I need. I'm done. But. All right. Uh, why not? I'm going to register for it.
Oh, I should have re-rolled that hero. I had junk. Ah, oh, whatever. Alright, let me see. They have to send you a verification code to log in. Wait, where'd it go? Where is spam? Oh, there it is. Am I dead? No, I just barely won that. Okay. Okay, we'll take Watchmen, because Watchmen's actually not bad. Certainly more useful than you. Okay, wait. How, do, how come I didn't get it? They were supposed to send me a... They were supposed to send me a code. They didn't send me a code. What the heck? That's very offensive. Why am I keeping Crow? I'm not trying to. I'm just trying to trying to get better heroes. I have not really seen much better than him. They did not send me a code. They are not sending me a code. I can't register. Oops, I died. Okay, now I have another chance to get a somebody to replace all this junk that I have. I died. Oh, Ripper. Okay. I feel like I fought this guy earlier. They straight up will not send me a an invite. Oh, here we go. I got it. Oh wait, I need an invitation code. No, maybe I don't. Oh, I registered. Okay, so I don't care about this MetaMask wallet. Watchman skill, what? Wait, what? Hey, Tyrael. So I have an invitation code. How do I do this? Marketplace? Hey, Samo. I'm trying to learn this. I am trying to learn how to play Idol Mystic, which is an NFT version of Tap Tap Heroes. Hey, wait. I just realized I'm at seven. Ouch! I'm at seven with this junk. Oh, even better. I'm gonna toss Bale. Well, actually, maybe I'll keep Bale. Okay, I'm gonna toss Watchmen then. Okay, we'll toss Watchmen.
All right, so game will launch here. I'm trying to figure this thing out, this website. Oh, do I have to buy keys to summon heroes or can I just play to get them? Okay, so a key is actually to summon a hero, which is $100. Oh, am I dead? Oh, I'm dead. Woo, I died. Yo, I need an NFT of Olivia. I, I need that. Someone needs to make me that. How do I make an NFT of a three, like a 2D model or something? Oh my god. What is this? What are these, these bad choices? Okay. Uh, Von Lester, it has been changed. It's actually not that surprising that it changed, so I think it's fine. Hey, Drogenis. Hey, long time no see. How do I... I'm very interested in this. Okay, yeah, they don't have a link to download, so you can't beta test anything. I'm telling you, if I get an NFT of Olivia... Come on, guys. Wear it. Thank you. Hey, I might actually get close to 400 points this time. I think my personal record was 494. And that was like the third weeks that Peaks came out. NFT. NFT is... <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is going to be the blind leading the blind, but NFT is basically, it's short for non-fungible token. It's effectively a digital item, a digital commodity that is limited in number, and therefore, even though all it is is like a picture or a movie, it is something that you can say only you own, and therefore... For some reason, that drives up the money. And so a company will be like, oh, we're releasing 100 NFTs of this character. Come and buy them when you can. And just because there's 100 of them, people will suddenly go, oh, I'm willing to spend $500,000 on it. And it's like, what the hell? Like the amount of money that goes into NFTs is ridiculous. It doesn't make sense. And so there's this game is called Idol Mystic. And it basically is an NFT version of Tap Tap Heroes. Which is like, what the hell? They they ripped I guess they bought the they bought the Cause Tap Tap Hero is actually No, signed Funko Pop is physical. NFTs are all digital. Um, but, okay, what was I going to say? So there was a time a couple years ago that Tap Tap Heroes actually straight up sold their game. And there was another company, or they sold like all the background code for the game. And um, there was a game that came out, I forgot what it was called, like Idle Adventure or Adventure Heroes or something, something like that that came out and uh, it you it had the exact same thing just with slightly different graphics and so it would not be surprising to me if this company that's running idle mystic also bought the tap tap hero game back then and then has just been sitting on it until now because i'm not i'm guessing that they don't have all the newest heroes in it so they just have an old version personalized audio file is an nft yes the problem is that it also has to be like officially minted as an nft in whatever format that that is i don't know how that works Oops.
people turn their tweets into NFTs and you're just like, what? What the hell is that? Okay, yes, not that TapTap Tap isn't a ripoff, but the thing is, at least TapTap, Tap, you know, they coded most of it from scratch, at least. They copied the concept of Idol Heroes, but they were at least their own game. They made their own game. And that one you can't deny. This is like straight up, they ripped the sprites directly from TapTap. Tap. Uh oh, I might be dead. Nope, Arwin! Arwin's the winner. The heroes are exactly the same. Exactly the same. It It's not officially out. It comes out next week. So they just have a website that is idolmystic.io. And so that you can see like a trailer. And I'm kind of interested by this trailer because TapTap Tap never really had a, a 3D animated movie like this. And so I'm kind of curious where this game got theirs from. Unless they ripped it from another game altogether and then combined it with TapTap Tap or something. I'm very interested in that. Oh, okay. Okay, Lorelei is gonna... Lorelei is taking the boot. Uh, Arrow, I don't believe that Tap Tap... Or that Idle Heroes can be considered more free-to-play friendly. I'm not sure about that one. Wait, actually, this is a bad idea. I'm going to tank Verthondi. I don't think I have the healing to support uh, Bryn as tank. She will die. Aqua, that's what it looks like. But yeah, artwork... I mean... Honestly, my take is just that I prefer physical things, so that's that's like the thing for me. Oh, Bryn just straight up died turn two. She got silenced and then dead. That's just great. And now everyone's dead. Okay, fine. Screw you too. I think by definition, any mobile gacha game is not free to play friendly. I got rid of my other assassin, didn't I? Nah, whatever. I'm just gonna go with this. I could have gotten rid of, uh, I could have gotten rid of Ripper, but whatever. It's oh, that hurts. Man, my Brin is a magnet. She's gonna die turn two. She died turn two. What the hell, man? Boy, I used Brin and she was completely useless every single time. All right, well, I mean, I ended at 379. That's probably my highest score in a long time. That's good enough for top 3,000. Drow is amazing in peaks. That is a given. She is absolutely amazing in peaks. All right, so that got me, I, when you last saw I had 1997, I got another 30 keys out of that. Like, this is so great for keys. So I really have more keys than I know what to, know what to do with right now. Uh, Lewis, the game got even more money hungry lately, which is actually what a lot of people are quitting right now. Hey, Nathan. And I don't, I don't blame them. I just wish they wouldn't, like, turn all their hatred against all the rest of the players while they're doing it. Like, if you're gonna quit, just quit. Don't, don't, like, 
transform into a monster and like yell at everybody for playing it and spend your whole time spouting nonsense about how the game sucks. No, I need more. Warpath? I feel like I've heard of that one. I don't know what to buy in all this stuff. Uh, I mean, Jerky, the question is how competitive are you with that one E5? Because, like, if that E5 is like a junk hero, it would... What's the difference between playing this and getting a T4, I don't know, Rillia in a month? Uh, so Arrow, the thing is, it all depends on what you want from this game. If you are expecting to reach the highest level of play in this game for free, you can do it with time. Like, I think that what people are arguing about, which is all the events having stuff that costs money, there's no reason to complain about that. Let the, let the people that want to spend, spend. You don't have to spend. You don't have to get the newest heroes in a month. In fact, free-to-play players have no right to be on that same field. I've always thought that. I have always thought that people that spend by nature deserve to win over people that don't but that mindset apparently is not one that is commonly shared and so like i think that people are just getting upset because they want to get upset i think it's okay to to make them spend for stuff it's not like you have to spend for it by not spending for it you are equally competitive against all the people that are also not spending for it So what? You lose to the top two whales, so you get third place. Is that so bad? I mean, do you need to be first? Do you deserve to be first against the whales? Oh. Nice. The only thing is, like... Okay, let's say I want to push Planet Trial, and you look at all the people that are pushing well with Mystic Tears, the Mythic Tears of the Goddess. You know, so what? So you're not there. So instead of, so instead of being up here, you're down here. Actually, Nathan, Secret Treasure last week was amazing. Secret Treasure, let me let me go get a picture. I where is it? Like the deals last week, they were amazing. I can't even complain about these. Take it easy, new sir. Thanks for stopping in. Like, look at these deals. You have five flags and five keys for a thousand. That's great. That's great. Keys for a thousand is great. Flags for a th or keys for a hundred is great. Flags for a hundred is great. The two thousand one, one miracle eye is about four hundred gems. So, So you're spending 1,600 gems on the Miracle Eyes, and that means you're spending 400 gems on seven advanced tokens. This is amazing! So, like, if they keep it like this, I, I hope they keep it like this. But the other downside is that they have changed up the... They have changed up Secret Treasure like 10 times over the course of the last year. And so you never know which version you're going to get. That's actually the dumbest part. 
So it shows that they still have good versions in there mixed in with the bad ones. And I don't know. We don't know. Okay, so. I mean, Arrow, again, it depends how competitive you want to be at the highest level. If you are okay with being like third place or fifth place and everything, free to play, then this game is just as fine. Hey, Akira. Um, I always say pull for new heroes, but only pull if you can reach two copies or th like only pull until you reach a copy and then stop. So basically you want to pull th the most perfect number is a is to have 740 keys on hand and pull because that gets you two copies from key reward and one guaranteed copy from up chest. That's the most efficient way to be. Um, so yes, I mean, we all need pet food. We all need all of that. But again, me fighting this is, or me doing this is playing against other people that also have not. Oh my God, Bios, you beat 220? D oh wait, that's a different one. Never mind. Never mind. I was thinking, uh, I was looking at this one. I mean, I think that pulling for new heroes is important. It's not for everybody. And yeah, Bios is free to play and he's winning this server. So what's the problem here? Uh, Nathan, we don't know. They have not released her full skills yet. So the only problem that I have in spending a lot in games like this is that at some point you will need to keep spending. Oh, I did beat Moonlight. I beat Moonlight 190. Alright, Qua, I mean, what is your argument, though? Oh, I can't answer that without knowing what, tier, what T4s you already have. The other answer is actually that nobody tries on this server. It's not dead. This guy spends. But... Yeah, it is a dying cluster. My lineup for 190. Uh, hold up. The lineup was actually the same as 180. Good night, Drogenis. Thanks for stopping in. Come on. Oh my god, Windows. Why are you so dumb sometimes? This is... Whoops. This was my lineup for 190. Which is exactly... Uh, Club Sound, it'll be in the next week or so. Probably in the next seven days, maybe six days, probably six days. So this is exactly the team that I was showing. Hey, Bulldog, this is the team that I was showing when I did it. And this team went ahead and cleared 190. It just didn't do it on. It didn't do it on stream. And just to show off, here is 180. Also with the exact same team and everything. So all of this straight up, it worked. It just took a lot of tries. I mean, I had to use Hodor Aegina because I don't have anything better. I don't have double Vivienne. I don't have double Kurt. Like you're looking at it. This is all I've got. I, I could make a double Vivienne. 
I can do that. I could make a second veg. And so, uh... I haven't decided what I want to do. As you can see, I am working on Chessia, but I don't have the fodder for it. I just... I just don't have fodder. I do not know where I'm going to make another 10 star. If I had double vivs... Double viv, maybe not. Double veg, I would think about it. And probably replace Hodor. Hey, Envision. Uh, jerky, so this is, this was kind of an exception. Normally Hodor is very unreliable in Planet Trial, but for lack of anything better, I did it because as you can see, Kurt and Aegina did all the damage. Hey, Gyan. Hodor is just kind of there. So, I mean, I can, hey, Steven, long time no see. I can go ahead and convert whatever I want. I've got I've got Phoenix stones for days on this account, but I'm just too I'm too I don't know. I don't feel that I need to change anything yet. Ha 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 ha. Arwin, I got one. I got two. I got two. I got five. I got five Arwins. This account has not been good with Arwins at all. Wait. And I have no converts. Uh, well, Steven, Xenoblade is done. I have finished it. It was the most cliche anime ending ever. But, I mean, it's fine. Acceptable. The perfect damage dealing team? There isn't one. There is only use the best of what you got. There's no such thing as perfect. Double Viv is great for Planet Trial and Den, and okay for splitting up in honor. Remember that Hodor's damage depends on the rest of your team. If you don't have somebody with bleed, burn, poison, or all of that, then Hodor's damage is very limited. Although Pasteur actually helps a little bit with that, because Pasteur does a bunch of poison damage. The peak of the story was Prison Island. Okay, so the big, the big Zanza reveal was fair, fair. You know what? I think I agree with that. Uh, the whole Dixon thing was dumb. The whole fighting a god thing was dumb. The whole turning the entire world into Telethias was dumb. Uh, Vincent and Vinci best for PvE? They kind of are. Kind of depends what you want. They're the most solid, but Edison can be good for damage and Raphael can be good for bursting. So depending on what your team is, depending on what your goal is, if you can make them work, they all can work. Um, yeah, Resident Evil 7 is next. On that note, where did I put it? I should have brought it over. I'll be right back. Let me go get it. Teddy. Yo, okay.
So I've had this for like a year and I haven't even opened it. As you can see, it is completely unopened. Manga or anime? Mm, I like both. Manga is better for deeper story, but anime is great for being lazy and just kind of turning it on and watching it in the background. And I don't have time to read manga anymore. Like that may come, that may sound weird, but I don't have the time to like pick up a, a, a book and read it. Not lately. And yes, Melia, oh my god, what did the, why? She was just there to get pooped on. Like, everything she wanted, she didn't get. Like, and she she only had sadness for the entire game. Oh god. Okay, whatever. That's not that strong. Like, even in the ending, they're just like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna watch over uh, Fiora and Shulk now. And so it's like she lost her she lost her city, she lost her relationship, she lost her brother, and she's just like, well, I'll just uh live vicariously through everyone else or something. I don't know. I don't know what I don't know what the whole point of was. She was they kind of uh didn't have didn't reward her character well. So, oh well, you know. Hey, Black Flame. I, okay, so, food came, so I actually am going to stop somewhat earlier today and go eat. But, Black Flame, if you do have questions, you are welcome to join the Discord. Link is below, and you can always ask there. Uh, there's always people around that are answering most questions, so tends to be very helpful. Oh yeah, I should try and beat 620 on this one. Maybe not doable without Brin, huh? Maybe I need Brin. Actually, uh, this account was almost ready to get Brin. It's got five, ooh, five? Six copies. So I was thinking of actually pulling for Bryn on this one. Cans from quests. I went on a, like a 10 day zero. I got zero for 10 days. I finally got one yesterday and nothing today. It's, it's bad. My can luck is abysmal. This song is called Salt Mines, is it? Oh, it is. Hey. This, this pet thing, like, I'm not even mad about it because it's pay to win. I'm mad about it because, uh, because my luck is just terrible and everything. Not everything, but most things. My luck is just overall pretty bad. Uh, no problem, Black Flame. It's very interesting because I didn't even think I wanted to make those videos, but they turned out to be very popular, and so... Now I've been doing it every week for the last however long I've been doing it. And since I got... A Which pet is more viable in PvE? Vincent is the safest. That's the, that's the end answer. Hey Breeze, Vincent is absolutely the safest pet. But he is also the most defensive pet. And so, if you are trying to build an offensive team, he's not the one you want. You probably want either Vinci, or Edison, or Raphael. But if you want to be defensive and solid, Vincent. It's kind of a hard choice. So anyway, this is the status of my pets now. Is I have Pasteur at 120 because I bought the stupid can from the the I bought the can from the event and now I've got one which I actually just got today I only need what 17 plus 
25. I only need 40, 42 more to finish him. Uh, Breeze, I'll let you know when I know anything. We haven't seen the new the new hero skills yet. So usually they'll be leaked. They probably won't be leaked until the hero is added to the Chinese servers. No, no, no. I got the yellow can in the pet event. I got 35 total at the end. In PvP, Pastor is amazing. Because he's... The reason that Pastor is amazing is because... No, not there. He drops the speed of two random people by 25. That can completely disrupt an entire team. If you're not using an Ultima team, this can completely ruin all energy or everything. Where did I get the red can? Uh, there was an event like three weeks ago. Like three weeks ago, there was an event with a red, with a red can for free. And I told people to go for that. A lot of people didn't. They went for something else instead. What was the event? I don't remember. It was like three weeks ago. Two weeks ago? Three weeks ago? Oh, who is calling? Come on. I don't want to answer that. The pet quest one. No, no, no. I got the... No, I'm talking about last week. Last week I didn't get it. The other... The, the pet one with the three quests a day, I did. Last week I didn't reach it, which was the Lotus Flowers one, the Chi Shi Chi Shi No, how do you pronounce that? Chi Shi Kurt or Bale. Kurt is more damage, Bale is more reliable. Yeah, so that one that we had to roll a lot in, I got. Seven twenty eight, three weeks ago. So I got that one. That one was hard. It was hard. I spent so many gems to do it and I ended up giving up and buying the weekly card. That one was just dumb. Veg is necessary? Actually, no. Veg is starting to be on the way out. He's still really good, but definitely there is room for improvement over him, and so he's no longer required. But he's amazing for PvE. He is, he is definitely still that. For PvP, he's falling off a little bit. Oh my god. I remember we were con we were estimating if people spent like... We were estimating that it could cost like 3,000 to 5,000 a day. But I was looking at spending 8,000 gems a day on that stuff. And I'm like, I can't afford this. So I just bought the weekly card and said screw it. Pet levels or increased potential levels. So basically what Pogi is saying. Is basically these stats are more important than anything else. You know. Maybe. Maybe. 2400 well i mean is it really that big 2400 attack is like a 15 percent or something and on some people even less than that like 2400 attack is less than 20 to 10 percent but then again that's that one factors into every multiplier whereas the individual stats factor based on the other things yeah, so because it gets multiplied, it actually changes everything by a lot. Hmm. 
for PVE Veg or Phoenix? Uh, that is... That's not really a good question, because if you have the option, you'd use both. Veg is if you need the crowd control to hold them down, and Phoenix is if you don't. Like, if you've got multiple... If you've got multiple, uh... Brins or something doing all the crowd controlling for you then maybe you don't need veg but if you're like focusing on killing them slowly with arwen then you're gonna need someone like veg or freya or someone to do the controlling for you vincent Ed Ugh. that's not a good question all pet combos work fine it just depends what you want them to do Like, if your goal is to use a defensive burst team, then yes, Vincent Edison's a great combo. That, so, that's, that's like the most open-ended question. Six copies gives a free extra copy. That is correct, because... Hero, aw Hi, Mukul. Hero Awakening gives you a free copy if you hit six stars. And you need six copies to hit six stars. Wait. Yeah, six copies. Five for ten stars and one more for... Sorry, not six stars. T1. That's what I meant. T1. Actually, somebody was doing a spreadsheet on the familiars. And they were saying it's a big jump. At every 10 levels so 180 to 181 190 to 191 that's where the biggest jump was and then it just kind of flattened out after that so the stat gain from 185 to 186 is not as big as the one from 180 to 181 how many total upgrades I believe it's f actually I don't know I guess it's f four levels it says good night Nelson so three upgrades, but four levels. But I am completely broke, and I can't even level up this one. But I mean, looking at the stats, like this one at 120 is less than one-tenth of these. And now, I know that this one caps at like 78,000, 75,000. But still, like looking at how much stat difference there is in these 80 levels is ridiculous. Hi, Call. We literally were just discussing that right now. So he is at like. He gains six times. He gains ten times the health and six times the attack. It's pretty ridiculous. So yeah, I'm definitely working on this, and I do want to be working on Einstein. But now I'm actually debating if I want to take these stars and aim for a scroll instead. Like I imagine that Einstein can never be obsoleted, but the scroll can be, and so it's kind of a tough call it really is a tough call hi zach how strong is what in mythic oh new bone grip uh myth bone grip didn't get a mythic i think you're thinking of something else bone grip did not get it they gave dragon ring giant lizard no giant lizard always had one so they gave dragon ring and then the two new artifacts Eye of the Storm and Eternal Flame. Bone Grip does not have a Mythic yet. Uh, Somia Deep, if you want her, pull her. So, like, by the time that I get 16 stars scroll probably is on the way out replaced by the next big thing and einstein may or may not be
Uh, so you mean this one. No, not this one. This one. I, I don't play with whales. I don't have anybody that does this. Uh, Steven, so the downside about that is... You can only buy one thing per three weeks. And therefore, by the time that you're ready to start thinking about it... It's going to take you months to, to do anything. So it's one can per three weeks. Because this is supposed to reset with the wheel event. But then this, you're not even guaranteed to get this in the, in the shop. You're not guaranteed to see the artifacts in the shop. So, like, no matter what you do, you're looking at 12 weeks for an artifact or... 18 times 3 54 weeks for this like it would take you a year to buy enough and that's a and that's assuming you actually got one star per three weeks which obviously you don't so it's it's kind of a it's kind of a stupid idea anyway it's kind of playing such a long game that it's almost not even worth it to think about the best artifact you're looking at it this one right here right now as of right now it's scroll but that can all change like nobody knows what's great art oracle is also good but only if you can get two of them and scroll is also only good if you can get two of them because mythic scroll is broken for for pve Like, this is so broken. Like, it does so much damage that it's better than an 88% artifact. Think about that. Why do I think that it is a scroll? Well, remember, this guy's got a scroll on his back. I don't think it's the same scroll, but they have precedent for scrolls being strong. Like, I don't believe that it is the same scroll. It's it's his own scroll right here. So, I, I mean, it could be, but nobody knows. There's no lore on artifacts. All right. Um, so... Tears, I don't know if it's worth it to go for it because one tiers three isn't enough. Rag is probably then the safest bet because you only need one. Because one mythic three tiers doesn't, is not a major impact. In PvP, I did, I should have said PvE. Did I mess up and say the wrong thing? I did say PvE. Yeah, for PvE, scroll is broken. So it kind of depends on your own thing. Uh, for PvP also, if you really think about it, battles are kind of taking a lot longer. So a battle that's going like six, seven, eight rounds, scroll is going to be more damage, I think. Somia Deep. No, I'm just going to keep keys until I have 10,000 keys. I'm never going to pull keys again. Ten thousand keys. That's my goal. Ten thousand. Who the heck are you? Okay. Ah. Uh... Yes, I'm pulling for the new hero. Hopefully, we can do a community poll stream for that. Uh, that'll be that'll be pretty good. I hope we can do that. I hope people come because we haven't had people for the last few community streams, and it's kind of lonely because it's just me. 
but we'll see what happens. Anyway, Verth, Phoenix, Freya, Vivian, Lorelei, Kurt. Oh, I don't know. I'd give you like a 6 out of 10 maybe. You need Skuld. You need Skuld, you need Hodor, you need Sigurd, you need Bryn. Skuld is probably the first improvement that you can make. And everyone else is just building on top of that. All right. Maybe not even a 6 out of 10. Maybe like a 5. 5.5 maybe. It wouldn't be a very high score. I guess it depends then. If your goal is for a single hero to be one-shotting, scroll is it. If your goal is to whittle them down, assuming they don't have ridiculous double viv healing or something like that, then rag is probably better. But... We are also talking about Mythic 3. So yeah, pound for pound, one rag is better than one scroll. That is a given. But when you say one rag versus... Then again, if you're going to say that, you're saying one scroll versus four rags? Then Ragnarok's better. Yeah. But like, it's hard to make use of four Ragnaroks. It actually is not easy to do that. Th now is the age where everybody except damage is pretty much using energy. And so it's rare to see four damage dealing art or four damage dealing heroes on one team. Like I've even benched my third Ragnarok. I don't have a place for it. And it's kind of sad. Uh, Liam, or Liam, sorry. None of the skins are all that amazing. Get whatever you want. Honestly, the red skins are not game changers. The Sig one is pretty good. The rest of them are whatever. Even the Sig one is like... It used to be really good, but only against other whales that also bought it. But now that you have pet speed, the, the speed gain from the skin is minimal effect. If they have more than 10 speed on their pets then your skin is useless. And so it's it's really hit a point where the skins are like, they really are just cosmetic. None of them are really great at this time. Oh, I just realized. Are there still no yellow skins? Yeah, you still can't get yellow skin shards. Wow. I don't know what they're doing with that. I never really cared about honor, and I still can't find room for a... I couldn't find room for a Ragnarok on my team. With... With this team, I can't fit a Ragnarok on it. There's, there's like, there's no way for me to put a Ragnarok on this team. If you saw yellow skins, I'd like to know, because I have I don't know where they are. I have no, I did not see them anywhere. Miracle eyes. Okay, let's take a quick look at that. Let's wheel. Where is it? Well, they weren't in the Valk event unless they're lower than 60 Miracle Eyes. Let me see if I can see that. No, people didn't take screenshots of it. Yeah, this that team has energy on Chestia and Aegina and Vivienne and Skuld. Like I have no room for a Ragnarok on that team, so I have no no easy use for Ragnarok. Someone took a picture of it. Uh, where did it say? Here we go. This one. 
it would it's not there under 20 or 40 so it would have to be in the 60 and nobody took a picture of the 60 and because it's not in the 80 or 100 so I don't think it's in miracle eyes I mean I could be wrong but I don't believe it's there. Yeah, 60 is gold and a 5-star shard. So no, there's no yellow skin shards in Miracle. Unless it's for 50. Wasn't there another one for 50? Hmm, I don't remember. Energy to let Hodor fire first round? Yes. There was another one for 50, actually. Oh, I gotta change everything. It's the 50? Alright. Alright, that makes sense. At least it's somewhere now. That's good to know. So I am busy buying wheel tokens because I want to try and finish the wheel event this round. I really want to... I really want to try and get that yellow can. Okay, after I got this one... Alright guys, that's going to be all for me tonight. Tomorrow will be Resident Evil. Hey Notch. Tomorrow will be this game, so we will be playing this tomorrow. I do not know how this is going to go because I haven't played a Resident Evil in a while, but we will see how this is going to work. And as for converting yellow skins to red, I don't think that it should be doable. I think they need to keep that as a pay as a paid resource. Forty-four. Oh, yeah, I see it. Okay. Alright. So, that'll be all for me tonight. Uh, thanks, guys, for watching. And I will see you tomorrow. Oh, I'm hungry. <laughs> I want to go eat. Alright, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow if you are interested in Resident Evil 7. Otherwise, be back Monday.